Sochi is one of the many places astronaut Chris Hatfield has photographed from the International Space Station. He described the mountains as corduroy pillows. Hatfield has been sharing his photos and thoughts on Twitter, bringing a whole new view of the planet to a lot of devoted fans. But how has Hatfield been reacting to the world as it passes by far below? That's one of the questions I had the chance to ask him today in a feature interview we'll have tomorrow night on The National. Here's a short excerpt. From where you are witnessing Earth, is it a kind of, you know, spiritual feeling, perhaps even a religious feeling that you're having when you're looking at Earth? <laughs> Peter, last night, or uh, last night our time, but as we were coming across Canada in the dark, um, we, we were coming north of the Great Lakes, so not too many big cities uh, just directly below us, but I could see the, the Maritimes coming up. I could see Quebec City and then, and then Gaspé and the Maritimes. And just as St. John's pulled into view ahead to our left, the sun started coming up over the horizon. And it comes up fast because we're going eight kilometers a second, so we, we come around the Earth just screaming around the earth and suddenly the, the sun just just burst into view in front of me as we cross Canada's east coast and it and not just the brightness of it and the heat of it but the the, the profound beauty of it, it it just brings tears to my eyes it's just such a magnificent uh, way to understand our planet well tomorrow Gian Gameshi also talks with Chris Hatfield on Q that's at 10 o'clock and 10 a.m. and 10 p.m. on CBC Radio 1.